The body of Mikola Bully, who went missing, was discovered in a river by police. The mother of two went missing three weeks ago while walking her dog down the riverside in Street Michaels on Wire, Lancashire. About 11.35 am local time on Sunday, Lancashire police were alerted to the river wire close to Rockliffe Road. There, officers unfortunately recovered a body, they stated. A statement read, Therefore we are unable to say if it was Ms. Bully because formal identification had not yet been performed. It also said that the death was being investigated as unexplained at the present time. We've shared the latest updates with Nicola's loved ones and are thinking of them during this trying time. For their own safety, we ask that you not disclose any information about them, they said in Lancashire Police. The developments were termed as heartbreaking and disturbing by Home Secretary Suella Braverman. Throughout this tragic moment, she wrote, My thoughts remain with Nicola's family. Mortgage consultant Ms. Bully was last seen on January 27, walking her Springer Spaniel Willow after leaving off her six- and nine-year-old daughters at school. Shortly after, both her dog and her phone, which was still on a work conference call, were discovered on a bench next to a precipitous riverbank. Authorities had previously stated their belief that the 45-year-old had gone into the river and that her disappearance was not suspicious. The body was discovered in the tiny town of Street Michaels on Wire, just a mile from where she was last seen. Several people came to the region to watch the search or film scenes related to it. As a result, police had to issue warnings and dispersal orders for disorderly conduct. Her family said the public's attention had been sidetracked from finding Nikki and more about conjecture and hearsay after numerous hypotheses were disseminated on social media. After divulging Ms. Bully's difficulties with menopause and alcohol to forestall any further conjecture, Lancashire police were met with criticism. Her particular vulnerabilities had been mentioned in previous statements, so this was expected. Although we know that Nikki would not have wanted this, there are people out there speculating and threatening to sell tales about her. Ms. Bully's family said they were aware that authorities were sharing the details beforehand. The Prime Minister and the Home Secretary both expressed worry over the police's decision to make public her personal information. The head of the Lancashire Police's Crime Division, Det Chief Supt Pauling Stables, has said that the division will be conducting an internal review of its investigation. The UK's Information Commissioner, John Edwards, added, Considering the high-profile nature of this case, we will be asking Lancashire Police to lay out how they took the decision to divulge this material. Fearing for their safety, locals engaged a security agency after visitors to the village were reported to have peered into windows and tried to unlock doors, some of whom were social media personalities. After stating that he had been in people's back gardens at night with torches, one influencer was arrested and fined. Having so many people at the site would have been catastrophic for the collection of evidence, as veteran Scotland Yard officer Peter Blexley told the BBC. Malicious texts addressed to parish council members were also a factor in the arrest of two people. According to Dal Babu, a former chief superintendent of the Metropolitan Police, the widespread interest in the case and the ensuing social media response was due to people falsely believing that they were experts on the matter. The police had to issue a dispersal order, he added, because people had come from all over the country to attend. As he continued, he said, I think what's happened on this occasion is the extraordinary degree of speculation, meaning that police officers rarely have ever released private information about individuals. A dialogue about what happens when you have unprecedented attention on social media is something police really need to be having, he said. Due to the proliferation of true crime shows, many people now consider themselves authorities on the subject. Rip, if you like, don't forget to subscribe our channel.